Hey guys, it's Missy Wolf, and I'm here with Kendra and Krista of Tiger Lily. Hey. <laughs> so, my gosh, first of all, I, I want to just tell you that I enjoyed so much watching some of your videos um, yesterday. My my daughter and I were cracking up at one in particular, but I want to talk about your guys' experience on Nash Next. Um, you know, a lot of our a lot of our audience may not be famil as familiar with Nash Next as, you know, some of the other shows that are out there, but Nash Next is a really cool show. So tell tell us about that. Yeah, we got involved in it. Well, it started in June, and so it was a like a six month process, and it was all online. And uh, there were several different challenges that we had to go through. Like uh, we had to do a cover song and do a video to that, and then we had to do um, like a live Periscope broadcast challenge. And there was just all these different challenges that we went through, and we ended up making it into the top ten, which was you know super amazing because there were so many mm -hmm. amazing artists throughout uh -huh. the throughout the whole process. And uh, the last challenge was actually a video um, animation video challenge. And we got mm -hmm. to work with uh, a college out of Florida, uh, Ringling College. And so that was super cool because we love our favorite, you know, part of music. Well, one of them, I guess, is our favorite part, but it's doing the music videos and stuff like that. Because right. we can really be creative and kind of just, you know, do what maybe people wouldn't expect. <laughs> and right. so we really had to with that, um, the animation video for the last challenge. And we got to be comic book characters, which we never thought would, would happen. And so that was <laughs> No, that that's that's awesome. So so overall, you know that that experience. How do you think that that's you know impacted your music career? Because you two are extremely talented, and um, I see you guys going you know really far in this. But how do you think that Nash Next has helped you with with your career? I think it's just helped us you know become more creative and just you know fine tune everything and. And yeah, through Nash Next, we definitely have met a, a bunch of awesome people, you know, all the other artists. Mm -hmm. We got to meet all of them that in the top 10 when we went to Nashville to meet them. But just uh, meeting everyone was an awesome experience, too. That, that's awesome. Yeah, I know. See, and, you know, what a lot of people don't realize is so Nash Next is online, but they, they show things online, um, the videos and everything. So it's it's kind of like watching a reality show online. It's It's really kind of cool. Um, I, I liked watching some of the challenges with, with everybody, and there are so many people that that were involved with this, and so keeping up with you all was pretty crazy, but um, it was so much fun, and I have to say that your video for Pretty Girls, I, I love, love, love that video, but when... The tear rolled down. I don't know which one of you it was when the tear rolled down your eye. I was, I lost it. I lost it. I was, I was crying. So, <laughs> how? We're not, we're never sure if that's good or bad. But it's, it's, you know, if we can make people cry, it's usually a good thing. Hopefully. Oh, well, it is because, you know, when people are relating to you, it's for, it, you know, it's for different reasons for everybody, for sure. But, you know, either we've been that person or we know somebody who is that girl who's just, you know, everybody thinks that this girl is so skinny and has it all and this and that, but they don't realize that that girl has so many challenges that she's hiding and she's emotional and, and alone. So that video, I think, touches on, on every girl in every situation and so yeah when the tear when the tear fell it totally got me and I was I was definitely choked up a bit but whose whose concept for the video was that uh, both of ours uh we just kind of you know we're thinking of a lot of different you know ideas what we could do to really portray the message of the song because that is so so important in that song mm -hmm. and um you know the I know you put me on like a string of pearls is such right. a big line in that song. So we thought yeah. we'd incorporate, you know, the pearls some way and uh, just do a few different, you know, something very simple, but something very powerful. And uh, that's just really, really what we wanted. Well, and, and that you, you did well because that video is extremely powerful and especially, you know, I don't want to give too much away because I want everybody to, to watch the video. Um, but it, it really was, there was a few moments in that video where I was just, I was, blown away so so good job on that I love that um, and then you know your song victory the opening message that was extremely moving and powerful what 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 was your idea behind that like was that your ultimate goal was you just wanted to you know send that message to everybody I mean it was so it was very powerful 
Yeah, I mean, we, Chris actually, she wrote that song when she was 15, and so um, we got around to it a few years later to record it, and Mm -hmm. um, then when we were putting the video together, we, you know, we had the song, which was, you know, sent a really strong message as it is, but we wanted the beginning to just really capture people's attention right away with just like this really just powerful message and so Chris and I you know kind of what we want to tell people and even for ourselves you know what what like a motto for ourselves and so mm-hmm. uh, we, we spent a little time on that just you know making sure it is exactly what we wanted to tell people and even to tell ourselves and uh, mm-hmm. I think it came across pretty well um, that video is also super fun and um, Victory right. yeah, and Pretty Girls are definitely they share very uh, powerful messages, very different messages. Um, definitely. But, yeah, we were happy with how yes. that one turned out too. <laughs> oh, oh, definitely. Now, the video that had me cracking up though was "Song of Us." Oh my gosh. Okay, whose idea was it for the Luke Bryan cardboard cutout? Well, again, I think we were just bouncing around. We we're like, we need something. You know, we need like someone like famous in this video. We need to make it big. You know. Um, but we're like, why not use cardboard cutouts of Luke Bryan and like Shelton? Yeah. Uh, we're both very have a we have a very um, different sense of humor, <laughs> so we thought that it would be like hilarious to put these cardboard cutouts back. Like they were our boyfriends throughout the movie and have us oh, yeah. going back and forth with him, forth, forth with him. But um, yeah, we just wanted to create something that would be a little bit of a, a plot twist for everyone, a little something of humor. Oh, yeah. But it yeah. was it was amazing, and my my daughter and I we were just cracking up laughing. And then okay, y'all had to make the teeth sparkle. That was the funniest thing to me. I couldn't even stand it. I was like, oh my gosh, these girls are nuts. They're fun. It's, it's just so over the top and so cheesy. It's just like, oh, this is great. Um, our videographer Nolan Johnson, he he uh, he helps us a lot with the ideas too, and or right. He's always um, you know he. He always knows we're going to have these wacko ideas, and he just brings them to life and, uh, you know, articulates the idea so well because we have all this random, like, let's do this and this and this, and right. you know, we don't know how to exactly put it all together. We always just uh, make sure we have our idea and what we want and always, you know, put it together so perfectly. So that it, one was that was probably the most fun we've had, you know, with one of our videos just because it's so... <laughs> well, you see, and then yeah. we, we filmed it in Bismarck, North Dakota, so... I don't know if it was more fun filming the video or seeing, um, you know, random people walk by and be like, what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was going to ask. I mean, you started off in a coffee shop, didn't you? So I was yeah. like, oh, my gosh, what are, these girls are so much fun. And, you know, so my daughter and I, we were just, we were hysterical. We were dying. We were laughing so hard. It was such a great video, and she loved it. But, but you girls, you know, you're, number one, you're absolutely breathtakingly beautiful, but you can sing so well. And I think just everything combined, like every, everyone needs to just love you and they need to connect with you immediately because you guys definitely, you know, offer some, you know, greatness to the music world, which I love. And you're releasing a new video. Is it this Thursday? Yeah, um, it's actually a cover video. We're gonna and we'll be releasing new original music this summer. Hopefully, we plan to go back to Nashville and record some new music because okay. we have been writing for the past two years. It's, I think it's been around two years since we released our last EP, and um, right. so we're just you know we've been working and writing a lot. And the cover we're actually releasing is a cover we did on Nash Next, but we're okay. releasing it on YouTube, you know, so not, cause not everyone, you know, necessarily saw it on Nash Next website right. or anything like that. Right. So we're going to it, you know, on YouTube. So even more people can have a chance to see it. And so we're excited to release it. We thought, you know, just end the year with a, with a video, you know, this year has been so crazy and amazing right. and uh, we can't believe 2016 holds, but yeah, we're going to release a, vi- a new video on, uh, Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. Well, yeah, when I saw that, I was like, all right, we're going to, we're going to rush this article. We're going to get this one posted, you know, quicker than what we usually do, because whenever there's any kind of um, launch, whether it's a CD or, you know, a a single or or a video, we like to have our articles correspond with that just to help promote you guys a little bit better. So we're going to, we're going to put a rush on this one and get this one released immediately. And then, so you guys have your, your six song EP, it's titled Victory and that's available. Is that available on iTunes? Yep, um, iTunes, Amazon, pretty much any online music store. It's also available at our 
website, tigerlily.com. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty much available anywhere you can find it. <laughs> All right, definitely. We'll make sure everybody has links to that and, and everything. And, you know, we we just came back from our holiday, you know, our, our Christmas break. And um, I was kind of watching you guys on social media, and I saw that you guys had a picture of you sledding recently. How? Yeah. You guys look like you had so much fun. That picture was great. So what was that like? I mean, you it just seems I want to go. <laughs> I want to do that now. You guys made it look like so much fun. Yeah, it definitely was a lot of fun. Um, one of my friends has been brought to snowboard with, so I tried snowboarding a little bit. And that didn't really work out so well, but it was still a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're lucky. We have a lot of snow here, but the cold isn't always that fun. But it was it was beautiful uh, when we went flooding, and it's just it's just a blast. You know, it's just fun to go out and, um, right. you know, put all the snow gear on and just feel like a huge Pillsbury Doughboy and, <laughs> and then roll down the hills. Oh, it's just, it's so much fun. Oh, that's awesome. Well, we look forward to, you know, your new video that you're releasing and, and the work that you have coming up. Can't wait to hear what you guys come up with, you know, for 2016. Now, are you, are you guys going to be touring anywhere? Are you going to be playing any shows that we can tell the fans where to find you? Um, well, there we will be, yeah, tigerly.com has all of our performances, which okay. we will be doing during the summer. Uh, Chris is still a senior in high school, so we can't quite do everything yet, um, you know, just during the year, but during the summer we tour all the time. And I believe there's going to be a tour with uh, Nash Next uh, coming up here. We're not sure on the dates of that, but as soon as we okay. release, we will be releasing that information as well. Absolutely. So super excited. Yeah, it's going to be super fun. Oh, definitely. Well, we look forward to all that you guys have coming up, and we can't wait to see, you know, all of that. And um, good luck to you girls on everything, and Happy New Year. So excited for 2016 to roll in. So um, thank thank you so much for taking the time to talk with us today, and keep us updated. You know, like you said, whenever you have anything coming up, let us know so we can help promote it for you. Awesome. Thank you so much. Happy New Year to you as well. Thank you. You guys have a great day. Yeah, you too. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.